Alright guys, so I just finished going through this shipper in my local Kruger, and look what I found. I found... I found the exclusives, plus not really an unspun Volvo, because the tab just goes in the license plate spot, but still, it's the first uh, chassis away from the body error I've come across, so I might pick that up, plus I like Volvo wagons, so... But there you go. Two sets of each. There's still... I, I just went through this shipper. There's still Lambo there. I've just walked by that shipper and saw, like, three of these out front. So, that's nice. I am pumped to find the Chevelle. I did drop this Chevelle, though, and bust the blister. So, that will be an opener, and I might get a second one, of, or a third one of those. So, I'll look for that. But that had mixes of M and P and N all in it. Um, here, let's set this down. There's an Audi right on the front. What is it? This from P. So, see, there's one of those. There's two of those. There's another one down there. So, um, I might thumb through the rest of these and just see what I find. Um, I'm pumped to find that because I, I love that Chevelle wagon, and I am so glad I got the exclusive of it now. Um, and these are just all over the place in here. So, yeah. Lots of good cars in these cases. Um, I did find an M case warp speeder in this one. In the trick, found the warp speeder treasure hunt. Um, and I did find an SVO mainline in there. But, I found a 32 Ford mainline in there. And I also found a couple of Audi Avants in there, too. There's another one of those uh, Land Cruisers. Okay. Well, I will I will scroll through these a little bit. I'll go back and see what's in the toy section and see what we find. Um, I'd love to find another one of those Chevelle wagons, though. All right, guys. So I ended up picking up a third set of exclusives. There was just enough in there that I just I decided I would take a set that, that I could open. Uh, there's so many bad cards in there, too. Um, so here's what we've got going on. Oh, let's see what's happening Let's just set this down. That's a mess. There was a bunch of L case and a dump bin up there. Got more J case. That looks like an L case car. Yeah. Um, that's a circle track five pack. That's cool. Got a few of them. Um, I can hang this back up and I might make a mess in the process. Yay. There was a triple tier basket here, but I haven't been here in a while now, so... Um, we've been having some sickness run through the house, but everybody's better now. Everybody's fine, but this means I had a delay on hunting. Oh, hello. Wow. Um, yeah. No zero fives there. Uh, okay. Jay Leno tank car, Yanko Stinger, F1, 300 SL tank car, F1. Wow. They got a whole bunch of those in. Wow, it's kind of full back here. I'm surprised. Look how he's moving parts. Wow. We got I8. We got Vet. We got C8 Vet. We got a Brat. And we got the Mercedes. There's the FJ. I have never seen the purple Type 3 moving parts. Uh, just, yeah, the Volkswagen. For those of y'all that don't speak Volkswagen. Um, so, I don't know if we just missed that round or what happened. And eh, nothing up there either. So, M2 World, nothing really changed. Muscle machines, there's still a ton of them here, but all of them are stuff we've seen a hundred times. Um, this is all the same stuff that was here, you know, a week, week and a half ago. Um, so that's kind of it. So, yeah. I'll hang this up. We got a tab on that's kind of bad. Got a transport here. That's a Golf 1259 on transports, though. We got, oh, hello, Rebel Machine. Got Lancia, another Rebel Machine, another Golf Porsche. So, anyway, some decent stuff. Hopefully, the music's not too loud in here and I get copyright thing. So, it's pretty loud tonight. And uh, I got a Walmart run I need to make tonight to get some groceries. And I might hit the other Kroger across town, too. So, we'll see. I will see y'all when I see you. Bye. 
Well, I gotta stand in my local target and missed it by that much. Yep, I still got two transit super vans and two Rock'em Sock'ems. I've already got the Astro and I've already got one of these. And I found that cool combi at uh, AutoZone. Still no T1s in the wild though. Main lines look like this. Yippee. Let's get out of here and go somewhere else. Well, guys, in my local Target, and main lines still look pretty bleh. With some returns from last year, it looks like, hanging up there. But, uh, look at that. Got one of those. And all I can say is, thank goodness for bendy cards. Because those were hanging too. All right. I would like to get the Cayman, but I am glad to get those two. We'll move on to the next one. All right, guys, back in my local Target this morning. Main line still looks like this, but guess what? Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, I can't even tell you. Oh, I can't even tell you how happy it makes me to find that. Oh, thank goodness. That one's a little scuffed up. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm going to have one to open anyway. There's the other one. I've already got a couple of Astros. Oh, that one's kind of scuffed up on it, too. Eh. I just have to see if I can clean that or something. I definitely want one to keep carded because the card art is part of what makes that awesome. So there's a third Barbie, but no third T1. Hang that back up. Um, only other thing I saw yes, yes, that I thought was kind of neat was actually a Monster Jam truck. They've got these now, Mystery Mutters. So it's like a it's like a color shifter, but you get a real deco on it afterwards. They've got a truck and like a grave digger. So I just thought that was kind of a neat idea for a monster truck. Uh, nothing really going on down here either. So I will happily get these and I will see y'all in the next one. Yes. Bye. Well, guys, you join me in a Target I have not been to since the 30th of December. Today is January 10th. So I figured we'd come by and see what we can see. Oof, not a lot. Not much down there. Some moving parts, but all older stuff. Uh, a couple of monster trucks. Oh, no way. No way. Absolutely nothing over here. We got two wheelie chairs. But, yes, more of them. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see if the blister's any better on these. Because, man, the ones I got are rough. Oh, that one is too. I don't know if y'all can see that on there. Yeah, there you can kind of see it. Ooh, any better on this one? A little bit. Not great. Mm. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Oh, there's those. I might get one of each. Um, and yeah, that's going to be it. I'll see you guys at the next one. Oh, wait. There's a custom small block, too. <laughs> Okay, bye. Hi guys, I am in a Target at about 5.30 in the afternoon. That's how main lines look, go figure. But, Matchbox is pretty stocked, new stuff. So, I grabbed these right away and I was like, oh, I'll film what I find. I've done this pig. Um, there's the white Bentley. What Tesla is that? Oh, that's the Fisker Karma. Oh, that's cool, yeah, I do want that. There's a second one of those. And we've got another ranch here, it looks like. Yeah, cool. There's the recolor of the swept side. I like that. New CT5V. The FedEx truck, which might actually get, I don't know. <laughs> um, Nissan NV van. Oh, recolor on the Re Renault. Nice, but there's the one I was after. That's the one I'm after. National Parks Bronco. Very cool. New National Parks. Awesome. And there is a second one in there. 
And then there's an INC card in the back. New lightning recolor for 70 years of matchbox. I kind of want that just because the card and it says 70 years on the door. I don't know if you can tell. There you go. There's two of them. There's a Wrangler Super Lift. Not my thing. A Ranchero. What is that? Oh, oh, is that the new vet? Yeah, the new vet recolor. Sweet. Um, another Ranchero. And then, whoa, whoa. What is that about? Is that... I heard that Matchbox might be doing, like, a red series, like, red editions for Target. That might be what that is. I'll have to investigate. But very cool. Was it 69 Camaro? There you go. Very cool. Any info on the back? Not that I see just right away, but anyway. Very cool. So, uh, so there's that. Nice little matchbox score. Um, I might, there's three of those. I might go ahead and get a second one. I'll check out those cards. Okay, hang on. Let's organize real quick. Three, two, three, and three. Doesn't look very organized, but give it a second. Now it is. <laughs> um, that's a solid five pack. Some nice cars in there. I picked up, if I can find it, yeah. This is the one I picked up the other day. I started to get it on film and then I didn't. It is Autobahn Express 4. Sorry, that's kind of messed up. There we go. But new recolor on the wagon, a new Julia color, a new TTRS, a 2002, and a Beetle. All cars in my collection already in a five pack. How often do you get to do that? So, very cool. Hang that back up and hang that up. Beetle up top. Okay. There's those guys. It's a nice Challenger sitting up there. Uh, it all looks old for the moment. I saw earlier today, I saw a Thomas the Tank Engine monster truck. Now, nothing on it showed that it was a treasure hunt, but I couldn't find it shown on the back with the with any of the other mixes that were there. So, I don't know what was up with that. That goes up there. And that goes up there too while we're doing it. There you go. Oh, missed. But, okay. Anyway, long enough video for now. Matchbox score. Very nice. There's the Hot Wheels skate stuff. It's all starting to hit targets. And all the main lines I got. Cool. See y'all in the next one. Okay, guys. Same store. Um, still the main lines. <laughs> but I was kind of going through the Johnny Lightnings and kind of hanging some stuff up. I uh, saw that Nikki Camaro. And I saw this Nikki Camaro. And if you aren't looking, you won't notice that the stripe on that one is black. And that one's white. Because that's the white lightning. Believe it or not. Hardly any difference at all. But that's the white lightning. How awesome is that? That's my second ever. That is cool. That's awesome. Well, that's a, uh, a solid score for 5.30 in the afternoon. And I will see you all on the next one. Bye. Hey, guys. Find me on a Kroger. I'm um, the one that this year I did well with the uh, van and the two Corvettes. Kind of at the same day. I came across. I got some stuff pulled right here. Came across what looks like a fresh shipper. There's another shipper and a dump bin back over that way by the aisle. And a couple of triple, triple tier baskets all have been gone through. This did not look like it had been gone through because super main lines of supers weren't out on the front. I just found my first one of that in this hole. It's all in case. I found three of these. That's the first one of those I found. And I thought just in case I'll roll camera. I probably won't. But 
I mean, what's the chance of a six o'clock in the evening super? Not great, but you know, crazier things have been done. I would love to find that. I've traded for it at this point. I have one. Um, a good friend over at Scale Racing Channel, Brandon, got me one. Um, and we traded super for super. I got one. Um, but I would love to find one. That's that's my favorite one this year. Because I collect Volkswagens and Audis, and I'm a wagon nut. So it would be absolutely nuts to find it. So... Boy, I like that car. Every time I look at it. Boy, that Cougar's nice. Alright. And there's a Hummer EV in the back. That's the last one. So, last row doesn't look great, but, you know, we'll see what we find. Excuse me. So, nothing back there. All the Batmobiles. <laughs> huh. Another Lancia, another Volvo, and another Volvo. That one's put together though. Unlike the one the other night. The last hole, there's four of those in there. I guess that would make sense, two in each end case. Oh. Well, there you go. Man, wouldn't that have been something? Last car. Okay, well, that was a good run up. Put these guys back in there. And, uh... Man, that was a good run at it. <laughs> I think that is untouched, although there's not a single regular treasure hunt in any of that. So, I'll see you guys at the next one. Bye! Well, guys, I'm in a CVS of all places. Uh, the toy section's right back there by the back door. There's like a handful of Hot Wheels, but then I spotted this. But if you look slowly, do you notice anything? That's right. That and that are GameStop exclusives. Now I got almost two sets of these. I think two sets. It was either one or two sets of these at a family dollar um, months ago. But I never had another one of these. There wasn't another one. So I grabbed these two. So I can finish that one and I might just open one of those. Maybe we'll swap it or something because I just, I love that Range Rover Deco. That's awesome. But this is weird. It is, there's A case, there's B case, there's H case. Look, there's the H case Jag and it says H case on the back of it. There's the Mustang. That's from K case. The, the cars in here are all over the map, man. Um, there's a white Lambo next to the 57 Chevy Honda City Turbo from A Case. So, this is just a weird mix of a little bit of everything. And these Range Rovers are in here all over. There's one, there's one, um, there's another one, there's another one. Aston, but I think there's another one back there somewhere. Anyway, oh, there you go. K case. So, yeah, an odd little thing here. So, I'm gonna pick up a few. Um, I'm gonna pick up those two, but then I might pick up some stuff like the Mighty K just because I might take another one for customs. And, um, I don't know, I might get these two. You can't go wrong there, right? Anyway, I will see y'all in the next one. Bye. Okay, guys, I got a full dump bin in my local Target and a full aisle over that way. I got a helper who is uh, very bored with me right now, but I got a basket full. I'll go over all that later because I don't have time right now. And I'll see y'all. Red Editions. Score. Well, good morning, everyone. It is MLK Day. My daughter is in school. My wife is out of town. And I am not working. Let's go hunting. Um, I just did Target all the way at the end down there. Um, I mean, nothing new this morning after my pretty good score yesterday. Um, finding some fresh stuff. Let's go in the old Dollar Tree and see what we find.
don't really expect much. They've had some leftover QKs hanging around, so. Stuff all looks to be the same old, same old that's been in here. Alright. Well, there we go. And, yep, that's all we need for today. Yeah, all this stuff is leftovers. Yeah, it is. All right, see y'all the next one. All right, guys, let's try out a Dollar General this morning. I will see you inside. Think back here. Man, oh, I actually got something on the bags. Oh, did I get another PK strap? Oh, yeah, there's stuff laying over there, though. PKs. Yeah, I don't think I'm fresh to it. Stores are the places to go right now. Uh huh. If you don't know, now you do. Um, where's the symbol on the car? I forget. Oh yeah, it's in the middle of the D. It's like ghosted. Here you go. Really hard to see that one. Probably is. Yeah, if there's two cases on that, man, there's no way they're all still here. Uh, let's see, let's go this way. Mm -mm. And down. At least it bounced off my toe. Well, boo. Man, I want that one. Okay. Let's see where these up. Where they can go. Up top. Oh! Never mind. That one doesn't hang. Alright, then. I don't see anything hanging out up top. Sometimes you find that in a dollar, dollar journal. And I'll see you on the next one. Well, okay, Skip. I'll give you one more chance here. <laughs> Let's go check out a CVS. Okay, I've been around the whole store. And this is the toy section. This stuff. And then a bunch of empty shelves. <laughs> Good old CVS. See y'all the next one. All right, guys. I'm going to go into another Dollar General, hoping to catch a PK drop. would love to get that 32 forward. So let's go inside and see what we find. All right. Let's see what we got. That Matchbox or Ooh, Maki. A couple of Cadillacs. 
old though. Red SVX. Mm. Mm. Oh, maybe that's the Fiat. A little blue Fiat 500. Okay. That's a ID4, but EV4 is what they're calling it. Okay, let's see if we got any Hot Wheels. Looks like a no. <laughs> huh. We got two. I got a donut and I see me rolling. Well, that means they're ready for a stock, so I need to ask. Okay, if I find anything, I'll let you know. Alright guys, let's check out Dollar General and Big Lots. I'll see you inside. Well, it doesn't look good here. Um, that is PK's remnants, isn't it? In. Oh, they did have an end case drop a long time ago. Okay. Well, I got a handful of Matchbox, which is in a really weird place up here. Why is that up there? It's not. Anyway, I got the Opal. Very nice. Got the Bronco. Yeah, no Bronco Chase, but I don't think we're going to find that at a Dollar General anyway. That's a nice five pack, though. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's go to uh, Big Lots and see what we find. There. A race team five pack. Okay. Okay, I'll try and do this in here, but music is really loud. Um, I did talk to somebody in the Dollar General and said that uh, they were actually in the process of unloading a truck right then, so uh, that's why they, they didn't know if they had more yet or not. So, anyway, oh, look, that premium set did hit. But these are all Chevelles. There's eight Chevelles, nine Chevelles. So, where's the rest of it? I would love to have one last shot at that Corvette, Chase. All right. A couple of the Batmans. What's that? More Batman? Yeah. Oh, and we got a Muscle Machines three-pack falling off. These aren't attached to anything. Okay. Let me... Re they don't even have a hanger. <laughs> hey, there's that. So, anyway. Um, let me... See if I can find anything. I can't see anything, but the music is loud, so let me look and I will be back with you. Alright, well, let's try out a Kroger. I never seem to hit right, so let's give it a shot. See you inside. Well, there's a, oh, there's a dump bin. I was looking for it. I dare say somebody's been going through that, too. Yeah, I mean, we got a custom Mustang 18 GT from J Case. Could you imagine? Be like when I flipped over that EK Corvette earlier. There's Jag. Yeah, I mean, I, I pretty well know it's been sorted through when A, there's four altogether instead of three, 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 three. Um, but also, like, the first three you pick up are from Q, J, and H case. So, three different cases all stacked together. This one usually gets hit pretty quick and I'm never gonna wait a minute that's BK's car hold up that's 2023 BK's that's new too isn't it that sweet driver yeah BK's ah. Ah, interesting okay well what's hanging on the peg behind me not much all that stuff so we got a couple of monster trucks let's see hang on let's go check the end cap okay right here let's see not b case huh 
I thought for sure I was going to run that corner and I was going to be full of BKs. Interesting. Well, now i got to find it. Maybe it's in the dump bin. Maybe that's why somebody sorted through all of it. Okay. Some jag and a jag. Another Mustang. Not on a super card. Okay. Alright, hang on. Well, so far today is the most amount of Hot Wheels I've seen, so maybe we need to go through this. I don't know. I mean, that's cute. I mean, if those are the only two things left sitting here, is it really worth digging around in? Um, yeah, well, okay, I'm going to put y'all down. I'll dig a little bit, but I'm not going to get carried away. And I'm certainly not going to dig out the whole dump bin. So, I'm looking down in there and I still don't see anything new like this. So, okay, well, I'll let y'all know if I find anything fun. Otherwise, see you at the next one. Okay, guys, next on our list is this little guy. I'm just kidding. So, I have the day off, so I'm trying out antique stores. This is the first Hot Wheel I've seen. It is on an absolutely wretched card. It's a Jaguar XK8. Which I kind of like. And I would take it loose. So they want five bucks for it. And they've taped the price tag to the card. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. So... There is a uh, have seen in this store. Thankfully, there is a bucket of Lucy's up there by the register. So we'll hit that and I'll let you know what I pick up. Okay, guys. So there's my paper bag of some. Well, that's about as far as we made it before the phone died. So I apologize. Um, I was in that antique store for a little bit. Got a phone call. It lasted about 15 minutes. And when I checked my phone, it said I had about 16% battery. I started to record that video and pff, whole phone just shut off. <laughs> so let's go back to our paper bag. Um, also, hadn't I, I hadn't filmed what I got at Target the other day with my daughter, so we'll just do all that here at once. Um, so my paper bag from my antique store. Um, some stuff that I got. I got a few loose cars. Um, I've been collecting the Time of Taxis, and I saw one that I didn't didn't have. Uh, some of these are in rougher shape. This one's actually pretty decent. So, got me a Time of Taxi. Got a... That's a Maverick, right? Yep. 71 Maverick Grabber in Race Team. So, thought that was a nice little casting. Not the same Maverick that, uh, like, just came out this year. It's a different one. So... Thought that was nice, so picked that one up too. Let's see what else we got. Got a Triumph TR6 in a livery I didn't have. That one's been played with a little bit, but that's all right. We can make a custom out of it or use it on our track, something like that. Let's grab a few so we can quit crinkling up the bag. Oh, I don't know. Gave it away, didn't I? <laughs> you already saw it. Um, found this Aston Martin 177. I believe it's from a multi-pack. So, happy to find that one. Um, you probably just saw it. This was the surprise for me. It was a combi in relatively good shape. There's a little mark right there on the roof. But, I mean, realistically... <laughs> it's in nice shape. It was in like a little uh, plastic bin full of loose cars. All right, the next two I have, here you go. Both of these are rough. This one is, let me remember the name of this one. This is a, this is a Hot Wheels. A Ferrari 333 SP. So, it is rough around the edges for sure. That spoiler's been, like, chewed on or something. <laughs> Maybe a doggy got a hold of that one. Maybe a baby. I don't know. But I don't know if I want to 
sort of touch it up and maybe try to replace the spoiler and kind of leave it as is, or if I want to just do a full resto. The axles are very rusty in it, and yeah. I don't know if I want to do a full restoration or just a just a custom. So, let's see if I can fix or replace that spoiler. And then we got, I believe this is a Matchbox. Yeah, Matchbox F40. Now, this was probably a really cool car at one point in time with that paint with that paint on there. The spoiler is bent down in the back, but the rest of it is pretty good. And I can probably get in there and level that back out without hurting the metal too much. And then I could just make me a whole new custom of this. I could strip this, make it all just Spectre Flame Red if I wanted to. Put some nicer wheels on it. That would come out really nice. Maybe uh, detail that engine bay, if you can see in there and all. There you go. But it's got a little, a little bounce to it. And actually rolls pretty good. So, uh, that was my antique store finds. 50 cents a car, by the way. Um, which I was more than pleased with. So, let me clear these out of the way and we'll move on to something else. And the commie. We'll set you over there. Sorry, my chair's all creaky. Um, I'll throw this in the mix, too. This is a box. I've already opened it. I know what it is. Um, I, very surprisingly to, to, to me, won a giveaway uh, from Jim Silva. So I will throw a link to his channel in the description so you guys can go over there and subscribe. He's got excellent tips for like restoring and customizing and lots of shorts, lots of YouTube shorts for that. But I won one of his giveaways, and that's what I won. Holy cow. I've, I've, I've nearly bought it a couple of times. I've nearly traded for it a couple of times, but never had it. Now I've got it. Oh my goodness. This, the finish on that car is just incredible. That is so nice. If my camera will focus. There you go. Man, that is nice. So, huge shout out to Jim Silva on that uh, that giveaway win. That was that was amazing. Um, yeah. So throw that back in the box. Get that out of the way, and we'll move on to target finds. Uh, of course, the big find was the trio of red editions, uh, compact Fords. You guys know me. That was that's awesome that that is a red edition. And I mean, really, can you? beat the Liberty Walk Sylvia? Oh my goodness, how cool is that? That that is a red edition. So, I got three sets. I got a set for... I got a set to keep carded like this, I got a set to open, and I got a set for a buddy of mine that works... Uh, he works through the night. And um, I got a set in case he couldn't get up there. I texted him as soon as I found him. Uh, and was like, hey man, red edition's target. <laughs> But he texted me like hours later, like, I just woke up. <laughs> like, that's what I thought, but I got you a set. Uh, so on the main lines, I have not seen any B case here. We've seen just a tiny bit of A case at Targets. That's it. Um, Walmart is still on J case from last year. No idea why. So several of these are B case cars, but glad to add them to the collection. The Volvo P1800 Gasser. Also the... Mainline to the Super from B Case, the 300 SL, I'm, that and the Camaro from C Case are the two Supers I'm looking forward to the most, I think. I think those are the ones I'm looking forward to the most. I'll just make another stack here so I can do this quickly. I found the Rimac Nevera. Um, I think that's a really cool car. The way they've built it is really neat. The black that you see here, here, the black that you see down through here is actually part of the interior of the car. The black that you see up there on top of the hood is too, if you can see that at all. But um, that's really neat. I hope I can pick up another one of these and do a custom because I'm just curious to kind of take it apart, see how it's made. Um, there's the other Maverick, not the grabber, but just the custom Ford Maverick. 
So really cool color on that one. And then of course the, the FC in that incredible green. Man, that's nice. So there's those found treasure hunt from C case. The logo is right up there. It is tiny. I don't think I can get this close enough for you to see. It is right up there. But uh, that's the treasure hunt for Sea Case. The white Pagani Zonda R. Ooh, man, that is nice. Boy, that's nice. The new recolor of the Maxima Drift Car. You know I'm going to end up with one of these. Ooh, that is cool. The chrome, the chrome engine bay. I'm looking forward to the uh, the customs I can make out of this because that uh, that engine bay is gonna gonna be nice to detail out. Okay, some other ones. Another main line of the super. Ah, this time the Camaro. So nice to add it in. Um, the very cool looking uh, bone shaker. I think that's really nice looking. Those white walls really set that off the Hot Wheels Unleashed design battle for the Roger Dodger very nicely done that that uh, kind of not really a digicam deco but kind of is at, at the same time I did find a second treasure hunt so I went ahead and grabbed it done with those treasure hunts now I've got a done and I've got C done so moving on Turbine Sublime. Yeah, I bought one. Yeah, they did the uh, Hot Wheels 55 race team set 105. They got me because <laughs> they just got me. The blue and orange together made a set out of it. Yep. I'm a sucker for it. Another Zonda R. Um, the one and only that I saw the entire time I was there out of a minimum of five cases of cars. Cool combi. I have one now. Yes. <laughs> uh, another from the 55 race team is the Dodge Van, which I would have gotten anyway in any deco. So that's awesome. And the 787B. Nice, nice casting that is now new to mainline. Only been premium up to this point. Um, I got another of the Maxima Wagon, because why not? There were several. Just like there was, I mean, it was so many red editions there. Uh, yeah. Got the Unimog. I've got, I think, all of the basic castings of that. Don't want to speak too soon. And the last Hot Wheels main line, the Gotta Go. Why did I get a Gotta Go when it's not a treasure hunt? <laughs> Because it's a toilet car, it's yellow, says number one on it. I'll let y'all do the math on that. I think it's funny. But anyway, <laughs> um, so other scores that we got at Target in that same run, we got Matchbox Collectors, the Type 3 Fastback. How awesome is that? That's awesome. I never found the purple moving parts Type 3, but very happy to find the Collectors. We found the 70 Datsun 510 Rally. I think that's very cool. Um, if y'all don't know, there's um, there's a thing called... Matchbox has uh, a thing called the Ambassadors. And this actually has, I believe, one of the Ambassadors' names on it. Because right behind it, it says Ambassador Rally. So I think that's what happened. Um, that's why you saw there was a 5-pack five 510 Rally last year that had Lamley's name on it. That ha that was part of that. And the third one I found was the 79 Freightliner. So, very cool truck. Actually looks like it will hook up to trailers. So, I'm definitely going to open that one. I've got trailers from when I was a kid that will probably hook right up to that. And the last thing on my stop at that Target, um, that was an expensive stop. <laughs> A green light. Yeah. With some funny looking wheels and a red base. Hmm. That's right. That is a green light target exclusive chase. 
when you see like red wheels and the red base in Target, that's an exclusive. This is the 2022 C8 Stingray, as you see. Uh, what's interesting about the, the showroom floor steer series is how they put the window sticker on the back of the, the card in here too. So the color of this car, which is honestly kind of horrible, uh, is called Caffeine Metallic. So it's a very brown with red wheels. Really clashes. <laughs> um, so that was my target run. So if we go back to the antique store where I was running around, I um, found those, those items and then... You guys saw we were checking out several dollar stores, Dollar Tree, Dollar General. The reason I was doing that was Dollar Generals were getting PK drops in my area, just kind of sporadically. Um, and they had been getting L case, but I missed that, you know, in the past several weeks. But uh, I walked into one. I think I went to two more Dollar Generals after my phone died. Walked into one. I uh, saw this hanging there and I was like, oh, they still have L case. Pegs were sort of picked through looking. The, uh, there was, I think I counted and down on the shelves all underneath the pegs, there was about a dozen cars just, you know, just down scattered everywhere. Like, like a Dollar General. Um, so I picked this up and I picked this, this up was still hanging there and I was like, yeah, sure, I'll take a one more Dollar General exclusive Mercedes in white. Um, but guys, I'm so ticked that my phone died. <laughs> I'm so ticked. Uh, because if these were hanging there, I walked in and I was like, oh, this must be L case. And they're all hanging, right? I'm like, oh, this must be L case. And I was like, oh, wait, that sort of looks purple. That almost looks like the Mustang. That's probably just, that's, that might be M case. Would they have M case at Dollar General? <gasps> <laughs> Heart attack ensued, followed by lots of anger that my phone was dead. That was hanging there. Number two on the peg. Had one car hanging in front of it. And I kind of pulled it back like that. Just saw the back wheel and just like, Full on the super shakes and like everything. Just like, ah, I have not found this. This was the first find. Um, oh my goodness. I could not believe it. Um, so yeah, I picked up those two. I did pick up another Maxima wagon because I'm addicted to them apparently. But yeah, there was no treasure hunt in there. Um, my best guess is part of the case was not stocked. And I must have come in not long after they had stocked the other part of that case. Um, there were not enough cars hanging there. I just, I, yeah, I'm completely dumbfounded that I got this car. I'm just, I'm starting to shake just now thinking about it again. Oh my goodness. Um, <laughs> it is such a nice looking super. It really is. Um, Spectre Flame Purple is definitely one of my favorites. Probably probably purple, green, and red are my favorites. Um, I'm one of the weird people. I don't like the gold supers all that much. Um, they don't like me either. Um, I've actually never found a gold super in the wild. That's not why I don't like them. I just, the color is not, doesn't do all that much for me. This just looks so, so different uh, compared to the to the main line. I mean, all I saw was, you know, that much of it and just immediately knew and just gasp, audible, loud gasp in the store. Um, <laughs> followed, followed by lots of anger and the fact that I didn't have my phone charged. Um, yeah. I don't know why the phone charger was not in the car. Um, but yeah, found that in dollar general. Um, just after the antique store, I think I went to two more Dollar Generals, and that was the that was the second one. Ah, oh, I am so glad to cross that one off the list. The only one I don't have now, um, of course, the FK Civic, the the KK Skyline. Never found either of those. I did trade for the N Case Audi. 
the wagon. I'm very glad because I've never found that one. And then uh, P and Q, the 32 Ford, which I was, which is what I was chasing at Dollar General, and ended up with this one. Um, and then the Q case Camaro, never found that. So, in the process of actually making an Audi, this was one of the black main lines. So, got it mostly polished. Um, yeah, so making an Audi custom, but I am pumped to have found that. Oh, man. Okay, well, this part of the video has been more than long enough. I will leave y'all to it. I'm still stunned on that find. And, um, and honestly, that find, because it's been a long time since I found a green light chase. So, yeah, I'll leave y'all to it. On to the next one. Okay, guys, in a target I hadn't been able to get up to in a few days. Um, there's a few things in here, but look at these two. Oh, my goodness. My Volkswagen collection and my wallet have differing opinions on that. There's some green light floating around in here. But look at this. Look at this. Da -da, da -da 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 -da. Yes, there's some more. Um, I might get another set. I don't want to get too many because there's not a ton that's out here. Oh my goodness. Oh, hello. Yeah. I guess we should probably look for that. There's a Zonda R in white. Good grief, that's pretty. Um, I thought I would at least pull out the camera. There's another Sylvia. Because I did not get to film it the other day when I had a little bit with me. Um... We'll do a quick super check and then probably just pick up a few. There's a P1800 gasser and nothing there we need. Or another rim back up, up there. there go. Another Sylvia. Um, this must have just got done. This must have just happened, man. Uh, oh, there's your treasure hunt. I've got my two and good. There's the bus. I didn't get the bus the other day. I like the bus. So, I didn't get the Camaro the other day either. The Camaro. Blue. Mm -hmm. El Camino. I'm on, I'm Red Edition Stupid. It's similar to Super Stupid, but not quite. I would not mind another one of those. Because I hate the mismatch wheels. I'm in that camp. That's not my thing. Another Sylvia. Wow. There's a draft nader. <laughs> There's a uh, treasure hunt from 2022 E case. No, that's not the treasure hunt. Yeah, that's 2021 J case. That's when it, that's its first release. Wow, that's special. Mm. There's only two supers really that's been leaked so far that I would like to get, and it's the Camaro, it's it's that Camaro, and the SL, the Mercedes from B case. So, all right, guys, that's it. I will pick up a couple, and I will see y'all on the next one. Bye, sweet. All right, guys, let's go check out a Dollar Tree. Uh, I've seen some posts of some people finding the Best Buy exclusives in here, so let's go see what we find. This is where I found the Matchbox Super Chase and the Kafer Racer. So. All right, guys, I got me a box for storage. Um, I definitely got Best Buy exclusives, which is awesome. I picked up one of the 22Bs. Um, sorry, I cut the cut the filming off quick in there because I, when I walked in around the corner um, another gentleman that I've run into several times was also in there and then um, our nice lady Brittany that works here thank you Brittany by the way um, she saw us both and went and got two cases from the back so I grabbed one of these left one and grabbed a set of exclusives and a couple of extra Porsches because they're really pretty <laughs> and honestly they remind me of like an old matchbox I had when I was a kid. Something about it. But got that, and we will go on to the next one. So, score. Got something to put them in, too. See you all next time. Bye. 
Good morning, everybody. I am in my local Target. We got a restock on four packs, on two packs, and on the mainline on the world, there is a GT40 in here. Uh, no chases in any of it. Got some Johnny Lightning 2, which this color I might have to consider WS6. Um, buddy of mine had one of these in high school. It was a ton of fun. <laughs> um, but, uh, but yeah, so no ultra reds or chases or anything this morning. It looks like I'm probably here a little late because there's only seven of those left and the stealth that's been here forever. So, um, but walking in, I saw it folded up on a, on a U-boat out here. What I was hoping was a, uh, what I was hoping was a, a folded up Mattel box and it looks like the dump bin's restock. That's weird. <laughs> nine 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 ten. Yeah, it's weird. Look at this. More red editions. Oh my word! I think it is. Okay, guys. Well, um, in other news, last night I managed to uh, slam my finger in the car door. You can see it nice and bruising up there. That's fun. So it's kind of hard to hold the phone, but I'm going to look through here. I don't really need any more red editions, but of course I'll check for a super and see what I can find. Okay, I'll let you know if I find anything good. All right, guys, I'm back. I hadn't made it too far and I found 68 Cobra Camaro. So I thought I would flip over with you guys. It's a red edition case, so I mean, you don't expect anything. Might have to get another escort. Okay, let's see. <gasps> no way. No freaking way. Guys, holy cow. And it's my first ever gold super in the wild. No way. Holy cow. Um, yeah, that just happened. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yes. And another combi. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so found two combis and a super. Okay, I'll see. I don't know if there's just one case or more than one. Um, That's amazing. And I will see you guys uh, in just a minute. Okay, bye. Okay, um, I found a main line also, if you can't tell. And I found that uh, Collector Series Matchbox in here. So I'm going to put all this back. Um, a lot of this is just left over what was in here. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to leave the reds. I think I might I might get an escort. I might get an extra escort to uh, wheel swap. Because I don't care for those wheels all that much. Okay. Alright, guys. I can't believe it. Uh, I'll take another look at it here in a second. Bye. Okay, guys, yeah, I paused an owl over here in the clearance aisle. Um, I think I'm actually going to get this Mercedes-Benz wagon. I've got a few of the wagons, but I don't have a premium version of it. Got a white roof. It says Mercedes-Benz service on it. Oh, service courtesy vehicle. El Segundo car dealership. No, El Segundo California dealership. That was throwing me off. That's tiny. <laughs> Hard to read. That's cool though. I like that. I found two combis. Um, I am going to get both. But then that gives me three total and I'm good there. Um, I'm going to get two escorts just to add to the Ford collection in general and one to wheel swap. The mainline Camaro. I'm going to get the bus because I didn't get the bus the other day. There you go. Holy cow. First gold super. That's amazing. A little bit of a dump bin corner. That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, guys. I'm going to go. 
and it really hurts to hold the phone with my finger like this. So, I'll see y'all in the next one. Score. Later. Okay, guys, in my local Dollar Tree, in one of them, and I walked by, the back door back there was open, and I could see this, and thank you, Miss Amanda. Um, she just um, got them out of the back room and cracked them for me. Now, this is the case with the Best Buy exclusives in it, which really I have. I'm good there, but I've got three chances at an Audi Super. All these are in cases. I'm going to hang up what I can. These are fairly full already. I may condense some of the matchbox and hang, hang up as much as I can for her. Um, but thank you, Miss Amanda, and I'll let you guys know what I find. Yeah, these are definitely not all going to fit. First layer of the first box, and I'm already this full. So, definitely going to need to condense that. Yeah, I might get another one. Maybe. I'll leave it out. <sighs> come on, Audi. Come on, Audi. Can't get the cardboard. That's a Volvo, I think. Yeah, that's a Volvo. Where is it? Am I missing a car? No. There's not one in here. Boo. Okay. Well, let me get the rest of these hung up. We'll go to the next one. Okay. I got some matchbox moved around. Got us a few more pegs. Um, there is an Audi in the top of this one. Obviously a main line. That's all that I see so far. There's our Subaru. Uh, yeah, that's all I see right now. So, I might pick up a whole other set of exclusives. Let's go ahead and grab a Porsche while I'm here. And wherever the clearing is, there's one. Okay. So, let me get these hung. And that might be all the space I got. Okay, be right back. Alright, I had to squeak them on there. And I left the Subaru right up front. Um, first one didn't have any Audis. Second one's not going to have two. No, for the shot. Okay, there is no room to hang these up. So, we're just going to look in the third case. Check the bottom real quick. Hang on. Okay, last chance. And doesn't look good. Nah, not in there. Alright. See you all next time. Alright, Kroger, be good to me this morning. Let's go see what we can find. Well, no pallets out this morning. My guy is down there stocking. Um, yeah, a bunch of, wait a minute, wait a minute, that B case landed, doggone it, it got out, oh. got out before I could get here, well, there's a handful of things I wouldn't mind picking up, random matchbox, did I even show that? Sorry. Uh, 86 V rocket box. I wouldn't mind another one of these. Um, I haven't picked up that Bentley. I'm not sure I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna let those kind of drop off on the collection. Maybe on that Subaru. There's the kit concept. So apparently there's an Easter egg on these. Apparently, that little slot in the bottom, you can shine a light through, and it makes, like, this part glow, and it also makes the front part glow. Supposedly. I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't tried yet. 
Uh, there's the Panamera Porsche. I haven't gotten one of these Baja haulers yet either. I'm not sure I want to. I usually like trucks like that, but me. Eh. Um, another Dimashini. There's a Camaro I haven't picked up yet. Ooh, there's a Huayra Roadster. I only found one of those so far. So that's going to be a yes. Okay, I put it up there with the Subaru and the other one. Let's see what's down here, if anything. A couple of monster trucks down there. Lots of metal machines. Lots of Deadpool scooters. And that's about it. Yeah. Well, we'll take a look at the old monster trucks anyway. Carbonator and Spider-Man. I haven't seen Spider-Man in a long time. Um, let's see, I see a race ace, the mainline Roger Dodger. Sorry, that wasn't a good shot. That's the whatever that is, some kind of dinosaur-looking one, and another race ace. Okay, oh. all right then. Um, we'll go see if there's anything in the other aisle. Oops, that doesn't work. Um, I know he was trying to get rid of the dump bin, so I'll let me get over there to where he is, and I'll uh, let you know if I find anything. Otherwise, they're probably going to pick up uh, those three. Okay, bye. Okay, guys, so the day I was here, and I forgot my phone. Um, he was stocking in seasonal, and he had a pallet sitting up there, and there was two brand new beat cases on it, sealed, and he was not going to open it because he had this triple tier basket out, there was a dump bin right here next to it, and then there's the wall over there. Um, he said that he was trying to sell a bunch off and get down to the get rid of the dump bin how is that sweet rides and it's hot chicken anyway moving on <laughs> so there's a handful of b-case cars in this and as you saw on the wall over there there was some so i don't know if both b-cases got put out or one b-case got put out but there's some stuff just kind of left over with the corvette um Yeah, but a lot of this is just older stuff. Um, yeah, like there's a B-case bricking trails, you know, and if that's all you're finding, then yeah. I mean, the little Lego cars are kind of fun. I mean, I could definitely see if you were a kid, that would be fun. But if that's all that's left on the pegs. I did find another Huayra Roadster, and thankfully another Kazi. So, um, I don't have too many of the red ones because I only saw like one AK drop at that target and that was it. So, glad to get another one of those for sure. There's an exclusive Land Cruiser hanging out. So, yeah, I don't know if both of them got put out or just one, but I'm late to the party no matter what. So, I'll pick up those two. And I'm picking up another one of these because that is just too nice looking. Um, probably get the other Huayra Roadster and get the, another WRX. So that's going to be it for now. Um, that's the most B case I've seen anywhere is these handful of cars. So yeah, I'll see y'all at the next one and we'll see if we can find a fresh drop somewhere. Bye.